Hi friends, welcome to the amazing adventures of the Pillow Fort Kids. I'm so glad that you've decided to join us today. Man, is it cold in here. Ollie, are you cold? Wow, it is so hard for me to go outside right now, but a good friend of mine called the other day and she said she left brownies in my mailbox. I was so excited. So I bundled up, I put my hat on, and I walked to the mailbox. And you know what I found when I got to the mailbox? A plate of brownies. This plate of brownies. Do you see what this is? This is a brown E. How rude! I was devastated. I love brownies that are made of chocolate. I didn't know what to do with this brown E. I had to remind my friend that when she's dishonest or doesn't tell me the whole truth, I can get really excited and then very let down. I was super sad. Today in our story, we are gonna learn about a couple who was dishonest. Let's open our Bibles to Acts 4 and 5 and learn more. The Holy Spirit gave Jesus' disciples power to tell others that Jesus is alive. More and more people trusted in Jesus. The believers met together in Jerusalem and they shared everything they had. No one said, this is mine. Everything they had belonged to all of them. No one was needy because the other believers would sell what they had to make sure everyone had enough. Ananias and his wife Sapphira sold some land and pretended to give all the money to the disciples, but they actually kept some of the money for themselves. When Ananias gave the money to the disciples, Peter asked him, why are you lying about what you gave? You are lying to God. When Ananias heard this, he fell down, died, and was buried. The people who heard what happened were afraid. A few hours later, Sapphira came to the disciples. She did not know what had happened to her husband. Peter asked her, is this all the money you got for the land? Sapphira said, yes, that's all of it. Peter told Sapphira he knew what, that she was lying to God. Then Sapphira fell dead too. And everyone in the church was afraid because of what happened to Ananias and Sapphira. Ananias and Sapphira pretended to be generous, but Jesus, he gave up everything so that he could share his riches with us and that we could know God. Remember that this week as you're hanging out with your friends. I hope you have a great week and we'll see you next time on the amazing adventures of the Pillow Fort Kids. Bye! See you next time on the amazing adventures